Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we are going to be trying out the Deadman brush. I recently got into the concept of curl training, which is where you basically, you train your curls to be more curly. Does it need more explanation? Probably not. I love my waves to all goodness, but I know my hair does have more potential in the curly department, so I've been trying to encourage that in it. Essentially, the Deadman brush is not only a detangling brush, but it's also a styling brush. Now, I'm new to this. I know this might be a very commonplace thing, but uh, I, it's new to me. It allows you to remove the bristles to adjust how tight or how spaced out you want your brush to be. The way you remove the bristles is you will take out the middle part. You gotta have some willpower. And as you can see, the little rows down here, you will just pull one of these out, push, and it just kind of pops out. I'm not gonna do that because I still need all my rows. So, and then you will just collapse it in on itself once again to place it with back within the brush. And yes, this is not an easy task. If you do kind of get the brush a little wet, it does go in a lot easier, but you're still, you're still pretty much shoving it in there. That's what she said. <laughs> We're going to do a first impression to the brush. We're going to see how well it does help with curl training. I'm sure it will help to a certain extent. I don't know how great the results will be. So I'm going to take a fairly large section and what I do is I have it placed here and I just slowly twist the brush and then I pull down. So I'm going to diffuse my hair and I will be back in a few something because I never know how long it takes to diffuse my hair to be honest. Animal crackers in my soup. Hey guys, so it's been about an hour since I filmed the last bit. Everything is pretty much dry I would say. Sometimes it's really hard to tell when you have a gel cast because it feels wet but you don't know. And this is what we are left with. I'm already really excited about this because, well, to be honest, whenever I finger curl, my finger curls don't usually stay in place. Maybe it's because I'm not curling them tight enough or something, but oh my goodness. So I have a little bit of a cast in right now. Um, I'm going to go ahead and scrunch it out. So I've fluffed out everything and I've broken up a bit of the bigger clumps and oh my gosh, I'm so happy. This is probably the best hair day I've had since going curly girl friendly, I will be quite honest. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm sure by tomorrow I will be back to my 2C wavy curls, but knowing that my hair can somehow achieve this through a little bit of help and a little bit of gel. That's really awesome. I don't know if I really want to claim this as my texture because I did like help it. So my overall thoughts on the Deadman brush, both on the detangling and the styling spectrum are A+. plus. I think this is probably gonna easily go into like my curly essentials. This kind of blew my mind. I didn't think it was really gonna work. I kind of went in optimistic, but I was also really prepared to kind of just have my normal wavy curls, but I have like legitimate 3A curls over here. Very loose, soft curls, which is fine by me. I'm rambling, I'm prattling, I'm rambling. 
I'm happy, I'm overjoyed that my hair looks like this right now. But yet it is also 8.30 at night and I am a grandmother so I will probably be going to bed pretty soon and potentially risk ruining some of the nice hair pattern I managed to create for myself. And yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you have an amazing day.